when it's something positive that you bring to a child's life and say, here, try this. And they try because they've never done it. It's like those moments where like, oh, and if it intrigues them, it's, they're going to want to keep doing it. My childhood, it was filled with a lot of uh, sadness. Yeah, there was moments of happiness. Uh, can't deny those. But there was a lot of moments of sadness. My biggest obstacles um, in overcoming obstacles, that I think has been the, the whole theme of my life. I discovered my talents when I was in the California Institution for Men at CIM in prison. It was a moment where I felt that I was finally doing something for myself. I didn't have any type of after school program or any other programs. Uh, having a program, especially arts, would have definitely changed the course of my life. So I grew up being bullied in elementary school because I didn't know how to speak English. I wanted those kids at school not to mess with me. And I started looking up to gangs at that age. So when I was 12, I got jumped into an actual gang. If I could talk to my younger self right now, I would say I love you. Because little Ezekiel didn't hear that much. And I remember I told my mom, I don't want to be part of this gang stuff no more. I'm done. I don't want to hurt no one no more. Dad, and she's like, are you sure? And I said, Mom, this was the stupidest thing I ever did in my life. My name is Ezequiel Gonzalez Lemos, and I am 29 years old. I have this opportunity to explore things, to try things, to fail at things, and to learn from things. 